Uh, I want to tell you, I, this actually, I had this song in mind uh, when I saw Wayne, who was doing all the, uh, like he was doing the, the compare bit, he was doing the seats, he was doing the lights, he was doing the video, he was coming around and doing everything, the whole show, you know, whole runs. And it reminded me of a, a, a character in Western Australia's sort of aviation history, a man called Jimmy Woods. And Jimmy Woods was a Scotsman and he was flying planes in the First World War. And there's a tiny island that we have called Rottnest Island. And if you go to the air terminal there, it's called the Jimmy Woods Terminal. Because after doing lots and lots of uh, World War I flying and then working for Sir Norman Brearley and delivering mail to Darwin and to Adelaide and being one of the first pilots to actually do that, those big long hauls in these tiny planes, which incidentally, if they went wrong in the air, they would just put them down on a track and pull them apart and put them back together again and then get back up in the air. And seat of the pants flying, really, it was. And uh, Jimmy Woods ended his days um, running what he called the shortest scheduled airline in the world. It was a, a 10 minute trip from Maylands Airport in Perth to Rottnest Island. And he was the kind of bloke that would uh, sell you the ticket in the ticket office he would load your bags into his big old Ford and then he would take you out to the airport and then he'd unload and put it on the plane and then uh, he'd get to you know check off everybody on the plane and then he'd fly the plane across and somebody once said to him he said is there anything that you don't do around here and he said yeah I don't do this this is winding up the landing wheels that's your job <laughs> And he used to put the strongest person uh, that was on the flight in the co-pilot seat. And there was a big handle here and he used to have to, as soon as he took off, he said, right, now wind. And it was apparently about 50 turns, quite heavy turns like that. And as soon as the wheels were up, it was only a 10 minute flight, so they had to go down again. So it was, uh, it was like that. And stories abound about Jimmy Woods. He was a bit of a character and the local newspaper cartoonist used to, you know, sort of, hoist him up and put him on with politicians, say if the politicians can't do it, Jimmy Woods will do it. You know? <laughs> so he was a kind of a larger than life character. He used to smoke a pipe. They said he smoked five boxes of matches to keep that pipe alight every day. <laughs> so uh, I've written a song in his memory and it's called Jimmy Woods, the Cowboy of the Air. And uh, if you feel like a bit of a fly with this one, um, it's got a bit at the, uh, the end that goes, fly you, oh fly you, fly you, fly you to the sweetest place on earth. Fly you, oh fly you, fly you, fly you to the sweetest place on earth. Jimmy Woods, he flew the Rottnest Run a dozen years or more In a pair of Avro Ansons that he salvaged from the war He'd pick you up in his big old Ford Stow your bags and you on board You were safer in the air than on the road And the unsuspecting passenger in the front seat of the plane He'd be winding up the landing wheels and winding down again which wasn't too polite on a ten minute flight But Jimmy's charms would always win them round Jimmy Woods, he was the cowboy of the air He knew all there was to know of wing and a prayer He'd pick you up at six o'clock in Perth And he'd fly you to the sweetest place on earth Fly you, oh fly you, fly you, fly you to the sweetest place on earth. In the early days of flying, Jimmy was a pioneer, and he thumbed his nose at gravity, bureaucracy and fear. He dropped news and medications to the lonely outback stations. He'd help out if he ever got the chance And the rules were meant for bending That was Jimmy's favourite tune He put two people on his wings From Derby down to Broome A legend in the making Adventure for the taking 
lying by the seat of his pants. Jimmy Woods, he was a cowboy of the air. He knew all there was to know of wing and a prayer. He'd pick you up at six o'clock in Perth, and he'd fly you to the sweetest place on earth. Fly you, oh fly you, fly you, fly you to the sweetest place on earth. Did you hear about the bloodshed when the bombs hit Roebuck Bay? He took 22 survivors out in a 10-seat broken plane. If it had wings, he would fly it. If there was hope, he would try it. And he wouldn't need a strip to bring her down. So when you see the little terminal on the tiny rock that style, and the name of Jimmy Woods will be remembered with a smile. The battler of the old school with a disregard for all rules, but a gentleman and pilot of renown. Jimmy Woods, he was the cowboy of the air. He knew all there was to know of wing and a prayer. He'd pick you up at six o'clock in Perth, and he'd fly you to the sweetest place on earth.